and girls, welcome to the Crafty Corner. I'm Miss Lisa, and you have joined me here today at the Fayette County Public Library. It is springtime, and if you guys are out traveling on the county road, you are going to see tractors, and there are a lot of them out there as the farmers start to plant. So I thought it would be a great idea to do a spring craft as a tractor. Now I've painted um, some craft sticks for you and I've made them green so it's sort of like the John Deere tractor and in your packet when you come you are going to find two yellow buttons, a little piece of cardstock, four long green sticks and three little tiny sticks. All you need for this craft boys and girls is some glue. Everything really has been done for you. So this is so super simple. You're going to take your white glue and slather it well on that cardstock. You guys, you really want those craft sticks to stick to the um, cardstock there. So just take your sticks and lay them. Some of them, this one has a little bit of a bump and a curve in it, but that's okay. It gives it a little character that way. So we're going to lay our craft sticks down. One, two, three, four in a row, and that's going to be the body of the tractor. To make the cab of the tractor, we are going to make like a square, but without the bottom. So we're going to want a little bit of glue on one of the half sticks and one glue there. I'm going to take our little half stick and just lay it right there on top. Press it down really well. Might have to hold it for just a little bit, boys and girls, so that it really sticks together. Then we're going to take the body of the tractor and glue it to the cab. So we're just going to need a dot of glue here and a dot of glue there. Bring your body of the tractor up and press it down. Now remember, boys and girls, that I've said a lot of times before you actually play with a craft or display it, you need to just let it set so that the glue all sticks together. So once you have that done, take your little yellow buttons and place them where you think the wheels of the tractor might be. And you're just going to add some glue and press down the bigger wheel in the back. The smaller button will be in the front. And now we have our little John Deere tractor. Isn't he adorable? All right, I'm not going to pick him up because he might fall over. But now I've got two. We've got two tractors that can go out into the fields and plow. All right, boys and girls, enjoy springtime. It's getting warmer and you'll be able to be outside so much more. Um, we have lots of books here at the library that um, have to do with tractors and farming. So come on down and see us um, here at the Fayette County Public Library. My name is Ms. Lisa and this has been the Crafty Corner. Join me again next Tuesday for another craft. Bye now.